Hey guys, um, on the last video I did of uh, drilling my soybeans, Nelson asked me if I had ever done a video of this cultipacker, and uh, I, I have not. I built this before I started doing YouTube videos, um, and this is actually the first time I've had it out of the barn for a couple years. Uh, but anyway, this is my homemade cultipacker. Um, the rollers are made out of 12 inch, I think it's 12 inch, single wall uh, plastic drainage pipe and they're just filled with concrete. Um, I used one inch iron pipe for an axle through each one and it had some other uh, short pieces of pipe welded onto the sides just to keep it centered inside of the drainage pipe. Um, the main cross beam is an old barn beam that a friend of mine gave me that sat here in the way until I decided to use it for something. Um, and then these pieces I think actually used to be floor joists in my house. Um, but anyway, where I've got, where the axles go through each of those, I've uh, slotted the holes here to allow it to have a little bit of flex so that it can kind of contour to the land. And uh, so each, each point on each roller is slotted. And then the main reason why I went with separate rollers or made the rollers separate instead of one piece like a lot of the homemade ones you see was so that you could turn more easily so looking at the tongue now the tongue is just made out of two by fours um, all this rectangular tubing that I used it's close to two by four um, tubing it's actually a metric size because it came out of a uh, shipping crate that I got from work um, that came from overseas so it's not actually inch size material but a 2x4 fits inside of it really well I actually used a lot of that material when I built my trailer um, and then also every place where I've got something joined together I bolted it together rather than using lag screws and I've got sandwich plates everywhere um, to keep the heads from sinking into the wood so that's it that's what I did um, sorry I don't have any video of actually building it um, I guess that was that was from before my YouTube days began um, but there it is uh, Actually, that is that over there is the rest of the piece of pipe that I used. And um, come on, zoom back out, darn you. There you go. And uh, if anybody watching this is in the central Indiana area and they want a piece of drainage pipe, let me know because I would love to rehome that. Anyway, uh, Thank you all for watching, and uh, hope you all have a good one.